Some evolutionary scientists have described Lucy as a supposed ape-like ancestor of humans since the 1970s. It's probably the world's most famous extinct ape. Lucy was roughly the size and shape of a chimpanzee, and scientists recently described a tiny foot from a toddler of this extinct species. But this foot looks like an ape's, which clearly clashes with the life science article title. Ancient human ancestors had to deal with climbing toddlers. Does this species really deserve human ancestor status? Zeresne Alemzeget from the University of Chicago discovered the remains back in 2000. He and other paleoanthropologists described the foot in science advances. He told Life Science that the big toe on the fossil's posted note size foot did not stick out to the side like it does in modern chimps, but was curved inward like today's tree climbing apes. This study author speculated that Lucy's kind could grasp and climb tree branches with its feet. So why call it a human ancestor if it possessed non-human feet? Even before this new foot description, some evolutionists have concluded that Lucy was just an ape kind. The late British zoologist Zolly Zuckerman declared, they are just apes. Evolutionists don't all agree that Lucy was a human ancestor because not one of its ape-shaped bones was shaped exactly like the corresponding bone in a human body. So both anatomy and evolutionary disagreement had already debunked Lucy as any kind of human ancestor. This new food fossil kicks that concept even further to the curb. The main evolutionary storyline favoring Lucy as a human ancestor involves famous footprints at Laetoli. Independent studies determined the African tracks exactly matched those of humans, but their position in sediment layers deemed older than the evolution's age assignment for humanity meant that something not human must have made them. The story reeks of evolution serving circular reasoning. An imaginary ape having human feet and body posture only exists in the mind of those who assume humans evolved from ape-like ancestors. But a look at the fossils instead of listening to evolutionary stories opens a new option. That the light totally tracks look human because actual humans made them. But this would force another rewrite of human evolution in general. This old evolutionary tale stubs its toe on this new fossil evidence that contradicts the life science news story title. The light totally track maker had straight human toes. Lucy's kind had curved big toes. Ape toes. Lucy never made those tracks, and without those imagined human feet attached to a Lucy, the only basis for imagining Lucy's kind as a human ancestor vanishes. Lucy was not becoming human, it was becoming extinct. A more truthful title for a news article on this fossil foot find would sound something like Curved Big Toe confirms Lucy was just an ape. Thanks for watching everyone, and may you all have a blessed day.